What? Sounds like... Make him go to jail! What? Downstairs in the kitchen. <sighs> what? leader of the USSR. He established Glasnost and Perestroika. He opened the Iron Curtain. He was in charge as communism collapsed across Eastern Europe. He has a distinctive birthmark across his Yes, body. yes. I, I know who Gorbachev is. Why would he be downstairs in our kitchen in Cabantili? I have no idea. That's what scares me. Mikhail Gorbachev is not downstairs. How do you know? He's just not. How can you be so certain? Surely we can't be that sure. What would Mikhail Gorbachev be doing in our house? Maybe he's furthering the spread of evil communism. The spread of evil? That, that doesn't make any sense. Communism is gone! Oh, that's just what they want you to think. This is crazy. Even if they were trying to spread... <laughs> evil communism? Why would they just do it... Downstairs? In our kitchen? In Cabin Tealy? <laughs> They've got to start somewhere. But... Wait! There it is again. I didn't hear anything. It's a kind of skittering sound. Skittering. Like the way a former Soviet leader skitters. Soviet leaders don't skitter. I said former Soviet leaders. All right. Former Soviet leader then. How do you know? How do you know they do skitter? Because I heard him. Listen, there it is again. How do you know it wasn't Nikita Khrushchev? Khrushchev's dead. <sighs> this is... Ridiculous, Helen. Of all the things you could be worrying about. Collapse of the financial system. Environmental catastrophe. Overthrow of law and order. Losing our jobs. The poisoning of our air, food and water by competitive industry. Religious conflict. Solar flares. Some kind of malevolent artificial superintelligence. And if you choose to worry about the rise of communism. Oh, come on, George. None of those things are real. But they're very real. Prove it. I can't right now prove that see, they're... They're just fantasies. They're, they're on the news all the time. Where's the news? I don't see the news anywhere, George. But I do hear Mikhail Gorbachev downstairs in the kitchen. <gasps> I think he just opened the biscuit tin. Why would he open the biscuit tin? Our biscuits are their biscuits under communism. It's their whole thing. I want our biscuits, George. It's why I bought them. Fine. I'll go downstairs and check them. No! You can't. What if he indoctrinates you? He's not going to indoctrinate me. Oh, come on, George. You know you're a regular library user. You're an easy target. Well, what do you want me to do then? I'd point it out. 